And yep, next everything's we're installed. Go and do is just jump the relay. All right. LBZ, this is gonna be a. All right. So what are we about to do? First startup. The first startup of the new turbo. And she lives. Woo! Hard work pays off, huh? Right, yeah. You ready? Should I, should I get on it a little bit? Let it kind of warm up and get some oil circulating. For a second, let right. some oil circulate. And then Woo. you did it, dude. Woo! All right, so we're going on a first ride in the what? The new turbo LLY? Yeah. Oh my god. I can already oh. hear it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh, dude. Bro. That is insane. All the wind noise, but. Oh my god. We'll just drive around the neighborhood a couple times. I just want to like send it. <laughs> Man, that is that is sick. Yeah, we should, actually, we need to go. We'll just go to Merck's house. All right, well, let's go see Merck. How goes it? Holy shit, dude! Did you hear me? Uh, yeah, I heard. It, all, all I heard was a whistle really? coming down through the. It's almost like. Uh, my light bar when the oh. wind's blowing the wrong way yeah. and it's whistling <laughs> like it's non-stop that sounds good all right guys here we are at Merck's house with the LOI as you can see she needs uh, she needs a little love it's been sitting outside for about three weeks during this pollen season Looking and rough. it looks kind of clean right here just because we've been like leaning over and then washing it, cleaning it with our shirts and whatnot. But man, the rest of the truck is just filthy. So we are gonna go ahead and wash her, bathe her, and then we're gonna go downtown and get some rollers, uh, get some sound clips. Man, look at the color. <laughs> oh, the color's coming back. You're doing things and <laughs> making me miss out on content. I did things. <laughs> Came with the ramp. Ladies and gentlemen, it's came with the Ram. Oh, he's one of those guys. He's one of those guys. Foily as I thought it was. Hey, I that. thought it was Foily. Dude, all right, that's what I want for our sponsors. Dude, that's sick. Oh, dude, that looks dope. Yo, that is so shiny. Look at that. Ooh. Got that crispy. Mm. That looks good. Ooh, I didn't want it there. Nah, I don't like it there. Now this is the video you guys have all been waiting for. Enjoy the next 15 to 20 minutes of Ryan's Diesel Services 64 millimeter turbo with a three inch downpipe. Let's go. You are not ready for this, but let's go. <laughs> oh my God. I, right now, I just don't know how well the camera can capture it. I do have my mic, so I'm hoping it will. But, oh my goodness. All right, turn left. And one thing I do have to say, with the combination of this turbo, I have a feeling my old turbo was on its way out. And the combination of this turbo and the three inch downpipe, 
the throttle response is just so much better. Before, my the throttle response used to be so bad. Anybody driving this truck would go like this. Right now, it's a much better consistent acceleration. So I gotta say, I still need to get this truck tuned and the turbo vane position sensor needs to be relearned as well. But even though like that needs to be done, this truck still spools up really quickly and there's really not a lot of boost lag. Probably because it's a 64 millimeter whereas, uh, you know, compared to the 68 that I was originally supposed to get. And I'm really impressed with this turbo so far. I'm, I'm ready to build this truck to get the full potential out of this turbo. So the next thing I'm gonna do is do the lift pump and uh, probably look at doing built trans and then we're probably gonna start adding more fuel so maybe bigger injectors or maybe even a bigger um, bigger pump. Oh, So currently we are in downtown Augusta. We're about to get some epic dronies. Cam is coming in clutch with the drone today. I didn't bring mine, but Cam's got his droney, so we're gonna get some pretty awesome dronies downtown Augusta. Turbo's gonna sound so good driving through like all these little alleyways in downtown. Whoa, check that thing out. <laughs> Yay or nay. Cam is pulling up right there because if you look at the sign, let's see, zoom in, 
it says Dodge Truck Service. So I think that's a pretty good location to take a picture of his truck. You know, because it's constantly getting serviced. I'm just playing. Here we are at this abandoned building. I wish there was a ramp so we can actually park our vehicles in here and take a picture. There used to be uh, a couple ramps over there and over there a long time ago, but then they blocked it off because they, they just didn't want anybody driving in here. But uh, I feel like this would be a sick photo shoot area. But um, the pictures out pictures look just as cool out here as well. Look at that. Ooh, came with the ram and the exhaust. A lot of people in Augusta, whether you have a car or a truck, actually come down here. This is a this is a pretty popular photo shoot area, right Cam? Yeah. It's gonna be a popular burnout spot soon. <laughs> Not in Mexico now, Mexico. with the new turbo. Yes. The throttle response is a bit better, isn't it? Take it to school, but school is canceled. <laughs> oh. 
All right, guys. Well, that concludes this video. Hope you guys enjoyed this whole 10, 15 minute. I think it might even be 20 minutes uh, of the turbo spool. I mean, I love, I absolutely love driving this truck. And I cannot wait to just start driving this every day as my daily driver. Uh, just to keep the miles off of the Denali because she's about to hit 200,000 miles. And I just don't want to see that happen yet. So, um... LOI has got like 213,000 miles, but I'm okay with it. I bought this truck knowing that it had a lot of miles and I plan on, you know, keeping it until 350,000 miles or whatever, you know, until it dies. I don't even think uh, I'll be able to put that many miles just because having this truck and the Denali and uh, I don't drive too much to work. I will be showing you a little clip after this, but we did take a stock L5P and a modified L5P, like tuned, deleted, um, aftermarket like bigger turbo built trans and we raced them you'll see just how fa how much faster a fully deleted l5p with built trans is compared to like a stock l5p on a leveling kit with 35 so stay tuned i will see you guys next time peace